here real quick. Got the tranny mount. Or the new uh, tra tranny mount, just in case though. It's alright. I'm going to throw all this back in the box. Bring the 77 down and then uh, take it in and get this put in. They shipped it out pretty quick too, guys. I ordered it uh, Thursday, I think it was, and it's Saturday now, so they sent this out pretty quick. But I didn't know if I was going to have to change and change uh, the appointment for getting the exhaust on, but they got it here pretty quick. All right. Got that baby up on the rack. Huh? Oh, this is nice. Yeah, that cross member fit pretty well. I just had to trim just a uh, little corner off right here because that was, uh, wouldn't reach the holes. All right, let me fire this up. <laughs> you want some light or you got a light on there? Nah, if, if you got something you could stick up under yeah, here. Yeah. So I'm here at my man Brian's shop today. And he's got the 77 Regal, and he ran these pipes for me. <laughs> they looking good up under there, guys. Wow. So, yeah, so what did you say you did here now? Because what he did, guys, I bought an aftermarket cross member for the, um, for the A-body, the, the 74. Three to seventy-six Regal Centuries. Had to trim a little bit off of right here. Ah, it okay. Was hitting where the floor drops there. All right, so guys, let me see if I can get in here. You can see it from right here. Yeah, he said you have to trim a little bit of this off right here, guys. So if you get one, you might have to do. Yeah, I see where you have to do that there. So yep, he had to do slight modifications, guys, just to get that to fit in there. See it from right here. Yeah, he said you have to trim a little bit of this off right here, guys. So if you get one, you might have to do... Yeah, I see where you have to do that there. So yeah, he had man. to do slight modifications, guys, just to get that to fit in there. Yeah, I was thinking about just drilling so you know, the holes because it was about an inch off, but then the uh, tranny mount didn't line didn't up. Didn't line up. Yeah, okay, so okay. It wouldn't have lined up. So yeah, I brought a new tranny mount. He put all of that on there. My man, she looks good. All right. Sounds good, too. Sounds good. Oh, yeah. What kind of mufflers you put on there? They're uh, accelerators. Accelerators? Yep. So show me the pipe bender, you don't mind. That's the pipe bender right there? Yep. Yeah, so this uh, does all the bending. Okay. And then this here, you can, like, flare and shrink the uh, end of the pipes. And then this is for uh, expanding. All right. So do you work on newer, you work on newer mufflers and stuff oh, yeah. too, right? Any exhaust pretty much. Okay, all right, because I got a guy down at the house. His, his car is kind of loud right now. I'm going to yeah, have to tell him. any exhaust. Any exhaust? Yeah, oh, okay. Kind of specialty, I guess. So now, <laughs> did you uh, check out the front end at all, or you didn't get to that? Uh, it seemed fairly tight. I mean, I There's didn't, something uh, popping, uh, doing there? something up under there. Tie rods are yeah, they, a little, little bit of play. A little bit of play, yeah. Yeah. yeah they're not real sloppy, but they, they're they pretty easy to move around. In. Yeah, yeah. Well, it might be just those springs he got in. I, I didn't notice he had all of those. I just brought this oh, car. Yeah, a little play right there. On the pitman arm. Pitman arm? Yep, so that could be popping. That right could there. be popping, huh? Like it's about to fall loose, ain't it? I just got a little bit of wiggle there. Oh, okay. Yeah, because I hear something popping when I That's move. That's probably so. what it is, I'll bet. All right. Oh, man. Got that disc brake kit on there. Huh? Got that new disc brake kit on there? No, these came with disc brake in the front. In the rear, they, they come with the drums. So, no, this year they come. But, man, Brian, that looks good up under there, my man. Yeah, so. thank you. Yeah, yeah, you be doing it. You got them tucked up on oh, the. Working on a Saturday. Got them uh, tucked he, up on the. Here for a pickup. I would have brought my car in if I knew you were. Uh, oh no, I'm just, uh, <laughs> just taking this off. 
But he's making a, look at making that. a video look at for that. YouTube. Look at that. So I like yeah. it in here. Yeah. So wow. Yeah, he put that in there real good. All right. All right, Are Brian. Wrenching? Did I just mess your video up? <laughs> no, no. You just in it hey, now. In <laughs> You're in it now. Yeah. That's all. Yeah. All right. <laughs> all right. Right. What's your name? Yeah, What's your name? Yeah, Randy. Randy? Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah, these were right back in the days, man. They still are. I mean, you just don't see them anymore. No, you like, don't see them that often. Yeah. So, yeah, this thing is out of Arizona. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's nice and oh, solid, yeah, man. Wow. Yeah. Took me 25 years to find this one, guys. I was looking I, for a long time. It's got the factory moonroof in it. Sunroof, I, I mean. had a burgundy one like this? Yeah. The burgundy really sets this car off, this body style. Oh, yeah. Color. Yeah. Red he had, or burgundy. And he, had, and he had burgundy top that went with it, too. Yeah. Um, yeah. This is a real sharp car. Yeah. Yeah. I got to just paint it up. One step down, he's got those duels on there for me. So, boy, who's this? Uh, that's a customer. That's another one I did the back. Oh, yeah? Uh, yeah. Let me see how they running out the back. Oh, he got his head. I hope mine start easier than this. Well, that, that's why this is in here. It's got a vacuum problem. He's fixing vacuum lines. Oh, okay. Uh -oh. Yeah, she really needs some pumps to get going. Hold it to the floor. All right. There we go. That's good. That, that sound good. That sound good. Took a little starting, guys. But she more started gas, more gas, more gas. The whole car. Oh yeah, yeah. Did That's you go nice. Two in the other shop. Uh, the other two cars in the other shop? No, I've, I've walked past and seen them. Is, is this that you next door or what? No, that's my son's, uh, it's all my son's business over here. Oh, okay. Here. All right. Well, I might want to catch him, let mine down and firing it up. Let me finish up over here real quick. I don't want to shut that off and have it not <laughs> <laughs> Let me uh, finish up over here. Yeah, she looks good. Yeah, yeah, those pipes look good up under there. I didn't want the tip sticking out, guys. So, yeah. One more thing down, guys. I'll be ready to start painting on this baby. Yeah, we'll give her a start up for a video. Huh? All right, all right. What is that, 76? 77. 77? I'm close, you know how I'm close? Woo! Now that's, that's far enough. Sounds good. And now she keeps running with me fine. I still, I ain't never touched this car. Uh, I, I still gotta do tune up and everything, you know. I bought this car about two summers ago and I'm just starting to mess with it, you know. Yeah, yeah, she sounded good. Brian, you look good in there! and everything so I do my paint and interior so I'm gonna tear that top off of there and make sure it ain't no rust and stuff up under. You want that left out? No you can put that back in there. Alright. Almost too nice of a day to want to be working on the car to get your last one of your last rides in. I know. Any golf at all this year? Oh, yeah. Wow. That baby's sounding good, though. Woo! 
That baby's sounding good. Yeah, that's the thing about a, an old school car. They don't have fuel injection, so they don't, they don't sound good right away when they start up because you gotta, you know, keep them running. But keep them running. Once, yeah, once right. they get running, boy, they sound good. Sound good. All right. All right. So guys, if you need any exhaust, any what front end? What what yeah, all you do? Brakes, exhaust. Okay. Pretty much anything uh, underneath the car. Underneath the car. Try to stay out of the inside. So. Okay. Okay. <laughs> you do engines at all? I'm or? Too old to crawl under dashes anymore. So. I got you. You do engines <laughs> uh, at all or not? No? Not really. Right not now. Not really. Get a little more space. Oh, okay. Okay. I did a few, but kind of backed me up a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Want to just keep rolling, there, huh? Up the shop a little bit, yeah. I got you. All right, so hey guys, if you if you uh, want to get in touch with Brian, give him that number one sure. more time. Two six two four nine eight one one two zero. All right, guys, Brian, man, he do good work in racing, Thank Wisconsin, you. guys. So come on down. All right, thanks.